I believe that we have the confidence and the optimism to, to overturn this result. Any question from the English media? You can turn this round in the second leg. Oh, it's difficult, I said, but of course we have confidence. We play home. I think that the, the second half that, that we played showed uh, the, the, that uh, we have the possibility to, to score goals and uh, we have to try. We, of course, we, we need uh, to do 100% uh, of uh, our quality, of our strength and uh, of our character. Napolista. What was lacking in the first half? The team would look um, to face some difficulties, uh, look clumsy. Was the approach wrong? Yes, the approach. The idea was to build the game from, from behind, knowing that we were not going to face the pressure from them, especially on our midfielders and defenders, but the idea was to build from our from the fence to, to find space in front, and that's why you have chosen to to strike us the, um, and not strong physically. But we, the idea was to get the ball to Fabian Ruiz and Zelinski to attack, but their pressure um, gave us a lot of problems. We didn't circulate the ball as we usually do. Then we changed in the second half, and the construction has been better. We controlled the game a little bit better, although we risked. Uh, in a few occasions, the counter-attack, but in the end, we had a, a few opportunities in the, in the second half. What didn't work, especially in the first part of the game? It's the same question. Let's try and ask different questions. The idea that you had before or the way that was implemented by the players? Uh, what worked in the second half instead? And what can you use from tonight's game into the return leg? As I said, we, we suffered a bit in the first half. We, we, as I said before, we wanted to build the game from the behind, trying to find the space in front. Um, didn't work in the first half. Um, but worked a little bit more in the second half, where Arsenal uh, didn't force us too much and uh, we found more space. Good evening. How can you try and teach these players to be more brave? What do you expect for the game? And, uh, in uh, how can you be braver? It's difficult to explain how to be brave. This team, through the game, has shown to have personality, character and quality. Perhaps they didn't succeed tonight, especially in the first part of the game. But I think we shouldn't over-dramatize this result. We knew it was going to be difficult. It would have, the qualification would have, would have been difficult. We knew it from before the game. I think this result takes all the, the fears away and brings us to play a game in the, in the return leg where we're going to have our supporters behind us. At the end of the game, you look disappointed, you are disappointed, angry or worried. How much did you miss um, a few alternatives on the badge for, for your midfield? I don't think it was a question of alternatives. I think we, what we lacked tonight was the performance in the first half. And I explained before, we weren't brave enough or we didn't have the quality to control the game as we wanted. Disappointed. I'm, I'm confident. I'm confident we can do it. Our impression was, was that we lost the game in, in the midfield tonight yeah, for, for the quality, but not just in the first half, but also in the second half.
No, la partita l'abbiamo persa nei primi 20 minuti. I think we lost the game in the first 20 minutes. Siamo sul classati. When we were overwhelmed. Soprattutto nella nella pressione, by the pressure and the forcing from Arsenal, we did have the calm and per difendere meglio, tant'è che due errori. We didn't defend sufficiently well, and the two goals considered are clearly two mistakes from us. In the previous games against Empoli and Genoa, the analysis was on the on the head and uh, and the fact that the old players were um, often on offside. Tonight, again, seven, seven times your players were caught offside. The, the idea was to try to find the spaces. We, in a couple of opportunities that we had in, in the first half, uh, we, we did well in attacking deep. Um, we, uh, we tried at times the uh, defenders being good in uh, getting us offside, but occasionally we, we, you can succeed. It's uh, something that we still should try and use in the return leg as well. I believe that the return match we will need a Napoli side like the one that we had in the Champions League games. Uh, could you try and uh, get into listen the Champions League anthem before the game? First, we need to focus on the match on Sunday's match. Then we will uh, start preparing this return leg. I'm sure that the first half on the return leg will be very different. I'm disappointed for that, but we need to start from what we've done in the second half tonight to overturn the result. English newspapers? Yes. If, if you don't manage to overturn the uh, match in the second leg, what does it mean for the rest of your season? Can you repeat? Sorry? If you don't manage to overturn the game in the second leg, what will it mean for the rest of the season for you guys? Because you'll, you'll be second well behind Juventus so far. Have you understood well? Yes. Come pensi di se dobbiamo ripartire dal, dal secondo tempo della partita e giocare come hanno giocato? No, no? cosa ha detto? No. 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 Sorry, eh? La stagione, nel caso in cui il Napoli dovesse essere eliminato, la stagione del Napoli che stagione è visto che sia dal secondo posto? I cannot judge the season now, so it's not. It's not the moment, I think. We have to wait until the end of the, the season. Give me uh, your telephone number and I will call you. <laughs> Carlo, Arsenal's away form is, is, is very different to their home form. Does that give you a particular hope that they won't be as strong away? As I said, it's really difficult for us, but we have to try. I think that we have, there is a different atmosphere, different ambient. We have nothing to lose, and so uh, I think that the second half uh, gave us some idea how we can play the next game. <clears throat> yes. Um, you said before the game that you knew this would be a very different Arsenal team to the ones you faced under Arsene Wenger, but were you still surprised how much more physical and aggressive they were? No, they were aggressive, really aggressive in the 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 the, the, the first half. We were, but we were not surprised. I think that uh, the performance of uh, <clears throat> uh, of Arsenal was really good at the beginning, uh, uh, but uh, <clears throat> I think that we helped them to play so well, <clears throat> and. Uh, I think that the second half was, was, was completely different. So the fact that uh, we pushed a lot at the end, we were, I think, physically better at the end of the game because they, some players had a lot of cramps. I think that this is another um, thing that we can um, uh, use uh, and. Uh, the game at San Paolo. San Paolo will be different. Of course, we have to play with a lot of intensity, but I think that physically, I think there was not a physical problem tonight. It was uh, other other kind of problem. L'ultima. Ah, sorry. Arsenal missed a few chances at the end of the match. Do you think 3-0 would have been too big a score? Mm. Um, was almost impossible. 
to nil. I think that we have some opportunity, not a lot, but uh, as I said, we will do our, our best. <clears throat> yes, Lady? Uh, Carlo, were you frustrated not to score an away goal because you did have a couple of good chances? Yeah, of course. 3-1 could be better for us, but we have to accept this result and uh, be focused uh, on what we have to do to create problem to Arsenal in the uh, home game. L'ultima, Mister Napoli. Lei dopo Empoli e Genoa. After the game against Empoli and Genoa, you said that you wanted to see um, a team that could defend better. But tonight, um, the team seems to be defending even worse than against Empoli and Genoa. Um, all the occasions that Arsenal had were through balls lost in, in the pitch. Is it true? Um, probably we, we felt that pressure, we weren't very calm, but we shouldn't now give up on what we do well. We need to fix a few things and not doing really well, and we must absolutely improve for the, for the return leg.